This peninsula basically is a migrant trap which gets unusually high concentrations of these migrant birds. So the birds end up being a really good measure of overall ecosystem health for a lot of reasons. Um, and so uh, it's true the, the numbers ha are much lower than they were a few decades ago, just the total number of migrants decreased. Uh, so the health of the birds, it's an indirect measure, but overall it is a measure of the health of our ecosystems to which we are also tied. <laughs> And banding was this hugely important tool uh, of understanding the, these patterns of migration. Hi. So it's important to to do all we can to to help them, um, and especially with the bird banding station, a big part of. The conservation is not just the research, um, but it's also the interacting with people and just educating people about these birds. So many people see our bird banding sign that have never, it's not even that they don't know what bird banding is, they just come in and they're like, oh, what, I saw this sign. And then they're like, oh my goodness, you have a bird in your hand. And you show them the bird and, or you give it to them, you know, the bird's not stressed to release it. and you just make that connection and these people leave changed um, and that you know Sarah and I would say you know we can do all the science we want but it's not you know unless we get people to also care and it's, it's not gonna matter um, we have to get more people aware of just these birds and what they're facing and it'd be a very sad sad quiet world without birds in it